Hey guys. Okay, I'd like you to imagine for a second that I'm not using my desktop computer and rather that I'm using uh, a Dell Inspiron Xeno HD or like a Mac Mini that's connected to your HD TV or just your regular regular TV in your living room. And now imagine that you've installed this program called XBMC which I'm just about to start running. Here it is. Now, XBMC is a media center that's open source and it works on all platforms like Mac, Windows, and Linux distributions. Um, as you can see right now, it's pretty ghetto looking and retarded. But what's cool about this program is it allow it's quite easy to install new um, uh, skins like the one I'm just about to change. Just give it a second. I'm changing it now. All right now, as you can see it becomes fucking awesome looking and kind of you know PS PS3 esque if you know what I mean um, let's go into movies now if you go into movies you can see how like you can see how like you can see my whole library and you can see how um, you know it displays like a, you know the the DVD cover and also like a cool backdrop of like some fan art which automatically um, gets put, uh, automatically is downloaded if I am uh, if it XMBC recognizes it which is really cool and what's also really cool is that X, X, um, XBMC also allows you to view your mo movies in like so many different ways like right now it's at list view let's change it to uh, multiplex if I change it to multiplex it kind of shows it as if it was you know like cover flow on uh, iTunes but it's a little cooler because it also shows you those awesome backdrops um, and if you just hover over it for a little bit, it also displays, um, you know, the d director, uh, who it was written by, the year it was made, you know, the genre, and even its IMDb, like, rating out of 10, which is awesome. It also shows, you know, like, a little summary of what the movie is about. And what also I love about this thing is, you know, it plays almost every single codec known to man, kind of just like, you know, VLC or whatever. Now let's just play a, a you know, shit like uh, Animatrix, which, by the way, thanks Niels for giving to me. And you can see, like, since this is an MKV file, it has um, its subtitles embedded into it, which is awesome because um, that allows me to, you know, change the subtitles on the fly. And this is not like a DVD; it's, you know, a normal, like a freaking, you know, like something I downloaded off the net, which is amazing. Now, let's go into shows. Uh, TV shows is pretty similar how it displays like um, on uh, the movies. It's a little different, but right now I don't have any shows. I just have Californication and uh, Dexter. Let's go into Dexter, which is... Dexter's an awesome show, by the way. You should all watch it. Um, see, it, display, you know, it displays in each season, and like again, it has a little, you know, the cool backdrop, which is, again, all automatically downloaded. Um, you know, and if you enter it, it, it gives you, like, a little thumbnail of each episode, and, uh, you know, it, it also gives you, again, with the little summary of each episode, which is awesome. Seriously, guys, you should totally watch the show, it's awesome. Okay, let's go into, let's go into music, uh, albums. And again, it shows it, it like, cover flow on iTunes. I haven't got it set up yet, but it also will do, uh fan art of the actual artist in the background same kind of way it does with the uh, with the movies I haven't got it set up yet but uh, it's possible and again there's multiple ways you can view all this crap so like right now it's on showcase so what another one I like is wall which just shows all your music in like a humongous wall I think it's completely cool let's, let's, let's play some uh, some uh, some block party uh, banquet See, this thing, I just love this so much. That's pretty much it. Um, if you guys recall, during the beginning of the Jekyll Maxon thread, it's, I asked for all you guys if it's possible to bring down your music. I mean, you're not your music, your, your videos, um, your movies, and, you know your TV shows because I would love to make this as this thing as large as I possibly can 
and it's something I really think would be cool. And for you guys in in the U.S., you know, you Boxy. There's there's add-ons for Box or not ba plugins for Boxy, uh, Hulu, and also Pandora. I th Pandora, I think. There's also an add-on so you can download podcasts directly into it, which I would love to do because I love my podcasts. Um, and guys, please, if you possibly, if, if it's possible, can you guys seriously bring your movies and stuff down here so I can copy them? Because I'd love to get this up and running on my TV as soon as possible. Thanks, guys.